Hey, how's it going, everyone? It's your hobby cat here with more Monster Hunter Mondays. Sadly, we're still not quite to 70. We're close. Gotta talk to TJ real fast. There's a special quest for you. Um, I'm doing a lot of hunting this week, working on builds and all. Just still haven't quite made it, but should be there for the next video. Turns out, since we have all these done, we're gonna help uh, Theo with a triple hunt. We got, uh, should be considered the secondary weakness for all three, being electric, thunder, whatever you wanna call it. Uh, currently, I'm at MR68, I believe it is. Uh, 70 is for Valstrax. Oh, wealthy man, nice. Take that. Getting low on tickets, I need to re-up, but that is what it is. Well, the cats make the grub. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, hit the notification icon, all that standard YouTube jazz, you know? Just a quick little thing for you. It means so much for me. My wife's been wondering why the square food suddenly turns round. But, uh... Yeah, I mean, it is, it is what it is. Um... A little bit of shop talk. The Great Sword Armor set that I was working on has two different versions outside of decorations. Both of them are fully crafted. And I have the sword needed for one of the great sword builds. So I gotta, I gotta work on the gems, and I'm working on the second sword for the, well, the second build. So we'll have an ice sword and a blast sword, and I'm working on a uh, light bow gun set. But unfortunately, some of those swords builds uh well they ended up requiring going all the way back to low rank to get items that i no longer had as it turns out so and trying to get those things just took a little while you know but we're working on it All right, I'm actually a little surprised that I have both with me, but that's quite all right. That's what I would prefer. This will be done in no time. Well, well. The only thing I really don't know at the moment is uh, which one I want to hunt first. I'm not sure that I really need these buffs, but just to be safe. Maybe I'll finally get a, uh, A decent talisman with, uh, I believe it's Spirit Bird's Call on it. I've been trying to find a good way to incorporate Spirit Bird's Call into a build because I like the idea of not having to run around gathering resources the whole time. I thought I'd seen something. Sorry, I have a sub quest that requires hunting helpers. I thought I'd seen something worthwhile. Lagambi's finally deciding to come out of its hole. And there it is. Target is in my sight. 
Gotta avoid that butt flam. Sadly, I missed out on that butt flam. I gotta admit, though, and I, I do think I might be a little uh, weak on my ice defense, but that was a decent hit for it. Oh man, it has been a while since I fought one of these. And not just for being a low end monster, I just never really found it here to be that interesting. So outside of original rise, I haven't hunted a lot of them. Okay, that's my bad. Didn't think it was gonna quite connect. Like Dark Souls and Monster Hunter, it's not always the best idea to stick to the booty. At least not against the Lagambi. Yeah. Have that bit of health. Must maintain my sharpen. Cool, but I completely missed. And we've already got a weak spray. Be down. Time for a much more annoying bit of prey. Oh, 
Enough, I just bought the other variety of this uh, a couple days ago, but with a weapon I'm not familiar with, it went all right, but it wasn't great. The mobility of this is rather annoying. Again, grab that. Little extra defense. Never hurt anybody. Especially against spinning pine cones of death. fact that it ate a lot of spicy food. I mean, isn't that what normally happens when you eat spicy food? You can spit fire from your mouth. And now it runs away. That figures. Going. Uh, then again, I do really need to sharpen. Great. Keep it up. Sharp edge, sharp hunter.
addition to that thing's tail can be annoying. Granted, there's also another monster that I don't think I've fought since maybe the initial hunt of it, or... If not the initial hunt, it's certainly been a while. I haven't had a reason to fight it. Are you suffering from some sort of ailment? I mean, admittedly, its gear does look pretty good. It's just its skills really didn't fit anything I was working on. And now that it's weak again, it shouldn't last much longer. And we can get on to the monster I actually want to hunt. Well, put this to use. I do wonder if this actually finishes up Theo and uh, Luchika's quest lines, though. Can't wait to chow that. We did it. All right. Where would we be without these stones? Hey there, buddy. Considering I'm having to use the, uh, well, not having to, but since I picked the secondary weakness, I don't know if it's actually, uh, strong enough for the fun move. fought an engine after in a while and I have missed this time. Admittedly it does help when I don't whip very kind like this.
maybe I'll just skip the aerial dual blade for a while. Just nip at his ankles. I'm back. I'm doing my impersonation of a chihuahua. <laughs> right at the, you know, right height. Go for the ankles. If any of y'all watching our Chihuahua owners, eh, don't take it personal. I've had good experiences with Chihuahuas, and I've had really bad experiences with Chihuahuas. So sometimes I can't help but joke about the stereotypes. I mean, at least I'm avoiding the Taco Bell jokes in this one. is not meant as anything process if you think that but uh if you're of a certain age y'all probably remember the taco bell commercial that had the chihuahua that was always about yokia taco bell or something like that who didn't love those commercials that chihuahua was fun and i think my wife is looking at me like i'm nuts She just wants to go to sleep. I'm not sure which. Three hunted. I'm fine, thanks. Not too bad. I'd rather hunt an Antonath on its own instead of not having to deal with the other two, but. I mean, at least going this route, I knew I'd get to hunt one thing I wanted to hunt in the fight. Destroyer oil. Could be wrong though. I haven't looked at uh, how Sword and Shield buff looked at in a while. Like I might have gotten some nice stuff though. Some fur, some carouses, fridge claw, more fur, feather, fur, a gem, okay, and the lash. Log bones and such. Royal certificates, yay. Random gathered materials. Fur claws. Oh, a nose bone. Uh, stuff from the Reno uh, Remobras. And from Boggies. A little over halfway through 68. So, unless something really goes wrong, Valstrax should be next week. Huh, a lot of stuff going on, but I kind of knew that was going to happen. Let's see if they have anything to say. Most grateful. Hey. Thank you for joining me on the quest. Luchika was pleased to have been able to sharpen her skills at your side. <laughs> I know her skills and her intelligence are unquestionable, so I'd like to give her the responsibility of leadership. 
but the younger knights especially are so taken aback by her uncharacteristic ferocity in battle. Yes. Of course, the more experienced knights simply smile and look on. Master Arlo in particular seems to enjoy it. I suppose it's just her nature, and until the others get used to it, I must thank you for hunting with her. So long. Do you have anything to say? Doesn't look it. Any new hunts from that? And that ends the end of that. Uh, Minoto, Hinoa, Arlo, Sushi, Gallius, Fugen, Rondine, Galli. Yeah. Okay, so that seems to be the end of their quest line. We've gotten all the gear from them. All right. Well, hey, thanks for spending time with me today. I'm going to have to finish getting stuff ready for Valstrax. For, uh, relearn how to play great sword all that fun stuff hope you all enjoyed it don't forget to like comment subscribe hit the notification all icon all that standard youtube jazz i'm your hobby cat and i'll see you all in the next one